Before this video starts, I just want to say shout out to COD Mobile for sponsoring today's video. If you want to check them out, make sure to go to the top of the description, click the link and check out their website. I'll make it all come true. Ooh. Hey, it's me, Booty Cheap Clapper here, back again with another brand new Call of Duty Mobile video. And today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new SMG brought with the release of Season 7. Of course, it's none other than the QQ9. But before we get into any games with it, let me just show you guys my class for the respawn game modes. That includes ranked game modes such as Domination, Hardpoint, and Team Deathmatch. My favorite thing to do with this weapon is literally just run at people. My play style is so shifted with it. But in order to obviously get a nuke, I'm going to have to play a certain way that's a little bit more passive and I'm not sure if this gun will work for it. I guess we'll find out. Either way, here is the class setup. Quick draw, X mag, long barrel. The perks, lightweight, vulture, dead silence. Now that the RC is not annoying anymore, thank God. We don't need cold blooded. Thank you, COD Mobile. Also, here's my search and destroy class. It's pretty much the exact same thing, except instead of using vulture, I've got on hardwire just so that I don't die to those pesky little trip mines. <laughs> But before we go into talking about the stats of the QQ9, make sure to hit that subscribe button because as of the time that we are recording this video, we're less than 20,000 subscribers away from 1 million. We're literally so close. Hit the subscribe button. So as you can see on screen right now, the QQ9 sits around middle of the pack for damage per shot when compared to the RUS, the PDW, the Cordite, the MSMC, and of course the Faro. This obviously makes it look like somewhat of an average sub machine gun. But because of the QQ9's insane fire rate, the time to kill is actually the best of any submachine gun, not including the burst faro. So technically, it's the best close range submachine gun in the game that is fully automatic. Now I take a look at the MSMC's recoil. How about the Cordite's recoil? Or maybe the PDW and the RUS's recoil? Notice anything about them? They're pretty damn horizontal. Now I take a look at the cutie spicy Chris little QQ9's recoil. It's damn vertical. It's really vertical. Until you get after around 12 shots, the QQ9's recoil is just vertically up, which makes it amazing if you want to control its recoil. As you guys know, vertical recoil is so much easier to control than horizontal. So judging just based off statistics, this is definitely one of the best submachine guns inside the entire game. So here's two clips of me using it inside of Ranked. How am I going to get out of this? Don't kill him. Applied. He's going to come through. I was still my kill, but I choked. I can when I first met you, couldn't get enough. It's all up to you now. Finish the mission. Three sixty. You love to see the QQ nine, bro. All right, let's hop into some HB ranked. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Let's do this, gamers. Let's roll out Autobots. Contact with enemy. I trip mined his home base flag. We lost Bravo. Is there anybody in here? Oh, I keep forgetting to change my score streaks. I want to keep like UAV on your own so that I can just spam. Spam them out, you know? Is 
<laughs> that guy was pre aiming me. Yanni. That's the worst, bro, when somebody infiltrates into your spawn. That's what I do, bro. Why everyone hates playing against me. I'm always in their spawn. I'm just lurking, dude. You never know. What are we on? 12? Please. Give me a nookie dookie wookie. That guy's so seen me. Is he gonna come up the ladder? No, he didn't even come up the ladder. Come on. Thank you. Shot. Give me that, Nick boy. Mm. MP5 looking, I mean, QQ9 looking jissy. <laughs> Let's go. You love to see it. Thank you. That is just unfortunate. I'm gonna um, forget that that happened. I don't know what you guys are talking about. QQ9, love to see it. So as you've seen from the first gameplay on Milton, the QQ9 is cracked. It's literally insane. But what happens in this next gameplay is just absolutely absurd. I'm the worst player in this game. Down, meet back up. Okay, okay, okay. What the frick? I have contact! I got shot! Nice little kill right there, boy! What? I'm such a hacker. My hacks are legit, bro. This life on Nick Time, bro. They've never experienced this on Nick Time, bro. They've never handled something like this on Nick Time before, bro. Alrighty. Oh, 
All right, don't go in that hard point, bro. I know you want to. No! Come on, man! Yeah. They had the hop in it? Come on, dude. I was on a tear. I was on some sort of different level. I was on a whole different Earth right there, a different planet. All right. I wonder how many kills I got there. 43 and O. Oh. You guys just seen the hard point on Nook Town Nook. How about a team deathmatch, Nook Town Nook? Yep, that is what is coming up next here with the QQ9. Enjoy. That wall with the MP5? Hello? Contact, New best gun confirmed? Q9's confirmed the best SMG in the game. I confirmed it myself. All right, that's going to wrap up today's video. Make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. Love you all. Live your life with purpose. And let's roll the outro. Bye.